What's going on, guys? Welcome back to my series here, playing Barbarossa. Let's uh, load up this game. After this, me and my buddy are going to be playing the uh, combat mission Normandy game that's coming out on Steam. Uh, the 28th, I think. So we we'll am be playing that. I can't wait for it because uh, it comes with the Slytherin's PBM++++, which basically means that it's going to... I don't have to email the game back and forth. Okay, so... This is the turn that we did. Beautiful! Oh, he has some troops here? Oh, he does. Oh, he's firing now. Ah, shoot. Front hit. Ricochet. Good. Keep firing. <laughs> I didn't even know this had a gun on it. Front upper hole hit. Ricochet. Mm. Oh. I love the freaking audio on this. It's beautiful. Front turret hit, ricochet. Dang it, man! It's like bouncing right off. I'm ripping apart his infantry. I didn't even know he had infantry. He chooses t his tanks really... He, I mean, not his tanks. He chooses his... Um, his units really well, because he has like double the number of tanks than me. He still has infantry with it. Are these, guys, are these guys KIA? Is that what's happening? So I took care of his infantry. Why did all these guys kind of like jump on each other? You see this? I had them... Ah. I don't know why they did that, but whatever. Why is only issuing one command? Shoot. They're all concentrating on my uh, Panzer III. He's smart. He's going after the Panzer III. Dude, you are taking... You're supposed to... Did I not give you orders to reverse? That's the problem. And you're turning around, which means your side armor is exposed to the enemy. So, that's great. Ah, uh, Just rotate this way. And then reverse back there. Thank you. And this guy has a gun. I didn't even know these whatever whatever you, these half tracks had a gun. It has some kind of oh, it has a thirty seven millimeter gun. Wow, that's good. So I got this guy going there, I got this guy going there, and I have this guy going there. Right there. So what I'll have you do, my friend, is I want to make sure everything is good by the time, you know, like, just everything looks good, you know? Make sure they're fully front to the enemy. So when they hit me, you know, it just ricochets. So what I have here is I have the infantry and these half tracks that are going to be forward with the tanks a little bit behind to kind of give that 
extra couple of meters, so the uh, their rounds, their AT rounds, don't um, the AP rounds, AP rounds, uh, don't penetrate my uh, tank hole. And hopefully my uh, infantry can, as they get closer in, can start targeting them with um, uh, Panzerfaust. But yeah, I mean, like literally everything is just bouncing off, which is not good. What the heck did you just do? Definitely gonna concentrate on the tanks that have the uh, what do you call it? Jeez, how many freaking tanks does he have that that, that have that forty-five? All the tanks have the forty-five millimeter gun versus my twenty millimeter gun, which basically means I'm screwed because he's gonna be able to penetrate my hole. At a, at a distance that I'm not going to be able to penetrate his hole. So, like, at this point, he'll be able to hit, break, destroy my tank. And if I fire, it's just going to ricochet. I have to get within so many... Only thing I could think of in this situation is to... As maybe he... I don't think he's going to focus on my infantry. He wouldn't do that. I mean, I honestly don't know at this point. I'm hoping to lure him in so the infantry can hit with him with the pounds of Foss. And then what I'm thinking is when he does that and he moves in closer, right, and I hit him with the pounds of Foss, maybe I can run and gun him with the um, Panzer IIs. I shouldn't have chose Panzer IIs. I didn't know they have such a crappy gun. But any little bit of extra few meters I can get, making sure he doesn't break my... Out of range. How can a motor be at... Mortar? Mortar. Be out of range. Seriously. All right, I think we're good to go. Like I said, last turn. I'm not going to do well on this. Definitely not. <laughs> All right, let's let go. I think I'm good to go at this point. Ah, dang it, man. I'll tell you. I, was, I think what happened was when I got the game, I didn't read through the stats there as well. Like, I should have read meeting engagement thinking, all right, well, I should have maybe seen if it was... I just didn't think the ground was going to be so flat and empty, you know? It's like... <laughs> it's like one big baseball field, you know? Like, <laughs> And at this point, like, there's no cover for the soldiers except that wheat field, which is not really cover, right? Uh, not good. <laughs> uh, if you have any suggestions, be sure to put it in the comments. Uh... Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Hopefully you guys enjoyed this. Catch you in the next one. See you then.